I am so excited I get to introduce you today to First Steps Conversations. And as you can see very plainly on the cover, it's conversations. Conversations for new and renewed believers about following Jesus. The whole dynamic of this is having a conversation between a discipler and the disciple. And in the midst of this conversation, whether it's a new believer or a renewed believer, it is about following Jesus. And in the midst of this conversation, what you will experience is Jesus will come and be right in the midst of your conversations. First of all, I note to the new believer, this will give you the foundation that you need to follow Jesus faithfully. Also for the renewed believer, discipleship and this conversation will help you reestablish perhaps a foundation that has been lost or even wasn't ever there. So First Steps Conversations, it's an actual conversation between a discipler and a disciple for renewed, for new and renewed believers about following Jesus. Now, as you go through this book, you will see conversation balloons. One is light green, one is dark blue, and then there will be sections where there will be a light green and a dark blue together. So what do they mean? Well, let me just talk to you about the light green. The light green is the discipler. When you see a light green balloon, the discipler takes the lead. The focus of that material is on the discipler. He'll talk, he'll converse, and he'll kind of move the material along. And then you'll come to sections that are a dark blue. That's the disciple. During those sections, the focus is upon the disciple. And the idea is the disciple responds and talks about the things that are important and also about the content. And then you will see sections where there's both a light green and a dark blue. That means the discipler, the light green, and the disciple, the dark blue, interact with one another. When I disciple somebody, I literally go back and forth. I have a conversation. I'll read a paragraph. The person I'm discipling will read a paragraph. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. This is what happens. Sooner or later, in the midst of that conversation, even though it seems arbitrary and perhaps even confined, but as you read the script back and forth, in the midst of that conversation, you'll know that Jesus is there and this is an issue of importance. Spend time at that moment and maybe even go off the script and discuss what is pertinent and relevant and pray for one another. First steps, conversations for new and renewed believers about following Jesus.